as you've now had your hip done and you're going to be heading home, it's very important that you continue to use both the uh, TED stockings and the skins. Um, you know the importance of the stockings are to prevent uh, any clots forming in your legs and the skins then will be put on to help um, just keep swelling down in your thigh and round about the wound. Uh, so after patients have had the shower it's probably easier for you to apply these stockings if you lie down on a bed or on a sofa and then you get the person to relax and then we can show you a I suppose an easy way that we think to put these stockings on because the most important part or most difficult part is getting these stockings over the ankle. So we're just going to watch um, Mandy put on these stockings. So first of all you would just um, put the stretch the stockings. That does help somewhat and you'll probably have one or two pairs to go home with. So we just um, pop the bag over the, the foot that you're going to apply them to and then we just stretch. You do need to be a bit strong and hold your breath, it seems to help. You just, there is, um, there is a, underneath the stocking you'll feel there's a, a raised area and that's to help you, uh, stop you slipping. So once you've got them in the right position you just pull them up. It's important that you get no wrinkles. Yeah, it's important that your partner helps you too. <laughs> Then once they're in position and you've got the heel in position, you just pull them back. You sometimes, um, if you need to, just go over the ankle and then just pull them down again. If this is on your affected leg, obviously, you, you do it nice and gently. But it really is important that you don't have any wrinkles or you will get, you can get pressure points developing behind your heel and also up behind your knees. So you just want them to be nice and firm and feel quite comfortable. And we'll just watch Mandy do the next one. If you find as well that this, the TEDs are causing you to have red areas round about your toes or it is causing pressure, it's important that you actually um, probably tell uh, Dr. Weinreich or report it to someone because we don't want you getting any pressure sores on your, on your feet. Okay, now you have to put on the skins. The skins are obviously, the, you'll need a hand to just, same position is easier, it's just to get them over your feet first. And they should be quite firm because you want them to help reduce the swelling in, in your thigh and also to help prevent any clots. But it's really, this is more to do with the swelling and give you support. And it's almost, it's important to put your affected leg in first as well so that you're not bending your knee up. You probably have got your skins already, but you can buy them from Dr. Wainwright's rooms. He has his, their skins made for you. So it's up to you whether you lie back on the bed on, or whether you feel at this point that you can stand up and put them on. It's whatever's more comfortable for you, but it's important that they, it's important that they fit properly. So it's good to have both the TEDs and these on and then you'll get the maximum protection against both clots and the swelling. And you can put the ice on top of that to help the swelling as well.